I'm sure you've seen all the delicious rice balls that Japan has to offer, and I bet some of you guys cry every day because you don't like seaweed and you're missing out. But don't cry. There's plenty of options for you. Specifically these two guys. I've been attacked since the dawn of time about calling rice balls rice balls when they're triangles. Well, I'm curious to see what you guys have to say now, because this is undeniably a rice ball. Let's start off with a chicken skune rice ball. It's a patty of ground chicken meat with a little cartilage thrown in for a little poppy crunch. Don't knock it until you try it. It's glazed with an absolutely delicious sauce that's pretty much the same as what you'd find in an yakitori restaurant, and it wouldn't be Japan without a little tartar sauce type bead in the middle. All in all, if you can get past the cartilage bits, this is probably my number one recommendation for people who don't like seafood type stuff, just because it's so far away. But if you don't like the cartilage, well my next favorite is an absolute banger. Next is an omu rice onigiri. I unironically get these a few times a month for breakfast. The top is a fluffy scrambled egg, but it kind of reminds me of that frozen puck of egg that you get on a frozen Jimmy Dean breakfast biscuit. I might have just gone too specific with my references. Underneath is a beautiful helping of ketchup, and it's hard to see, but there's actually a little bit of a yolk sauce in here as well. Next time you get invited to an onigiri party, just grab one of these instead of not going. 